Hey y'all, welcome back to Spirit of the Outdoors. Brought Brody down here with his basket, and y'all, he has found some chanterelles down here. His mama made mention that we needed to can some more, so we're going to pick a few and see if we can can them out. You found one there, he's found another one over there. And they just scattered a little here, there, and yonder, and y'all, they are starting to sort of dry up. Uh, but now, I have found that when chanterelles get a little dry, you can soak them in a bucket of water, rehydrate them. So, I may show you that before this is over with. I don't know. But we're just picking some mushrooms. That's a big one. Let me see in your basket. Oh, yeah, you got a few. Yes, yeah, we'll get them too. Y'all, I'm, I'm more on snake patrol. He's on picking mushrooms. Now, we ain't seen no snake, but I'm watching for him. that log right there. See that little piece of firewood? Look behind it. You see it now? That one's hiding, wouldn't it? It's hiding. Yeah, easy pulling them out. Tearing them up. I've heard something land hit beside me. Y'all see all them pine needles? Pine, well, pine cone petals, I guess is what they are. Squirrels is up there. Somewhere eating pine cone. Guess what I found up here? Look down. What happened? <laughs> pick them. You pick them. Mikey told me you pick them. Is there a bunch of them? Yeah. We found a mother load, didn't we? Yeah. What What kind of mushrooms are them? Ten trails. They what? What kind are they, Brody? Chantrails. Chantrails. Here's one. Tell me again. Tell me. happy is this your favorite thing to do y'all this is his number one favorite activity to do and it's because since he was really little this is what me and him got out and walked around the woods and done now i have to fuss at him because sometimes he goes to picking the little bitty ones and i like to leave a few and let them grow but it is dry and we're going into our dry season here usually august and september is really dry here 
Now we had some dry weather back earlier and they all dried up and died. So I figured that's probably what's gonna happen here, but we've been getting a shower alone. So a few showers here and there will help these sprout up, but we've had a pretty good bit of rain last week and week before. And that's why we're finding some chanterelles. And I know these areas on my property right here where we finding them. So I know right where to go look, but I, I figure today I could go down there into the swamp if I wanted to and find a bunch of them. Uh, I kind of looked in an area where we grow some cinnabars, the red ones, and I did not see any. So I'm just kind of looking around while he's sitting there picking. He's he's having him a field day. But we found a good many, so we'll... Uh... You found some more? He gets all excited. I'm glad, though. Um, so we are going. We're going to take these and can them. My wife, we we canned some last year. Um, I have an old video on canning these. You have to pressure can them. What? Huh? I found some more. Yeah, you found some more. Well, I can't pick up the ones. Yeah, don't pick the little ones, but they some big ones right there. Pick them two big ones if you want to. I don't know. Why they well, they gotta grow. Yeah, they'll get big like them other ones if you leave them alone. They, they get big. Yes, to learn. Like the tree. They won't get big as a tree, but they'll get big as some of them other ones in your basket. Because <laughs> they ain't had enough water. We at that why stage. Everything's why. Cause they didn't get no water. <laughs> Jesus has to water them. He rains on them and that waters them and makes them grow. He raised them at his house. This is his house. You know where Jesus' house is? Yeah. Where? Um, yeah. Turn around and look at me. You know where Jesus' house is? Yeah. Right there. Inside Brody. Y'all, you have to keep in mind that they don't know. Nothing. You have to explain. That's why he asked why. He wants to know. It's easy to get frustrated and get tired of it. But. Bunch of them, Mr. Brody. Well, tell everybody goodbye. Bye. Say so we'll see you next time on Spirit of the Outdoors. See you next time. Say so y'all have a good one. You have a good one. And tell them say the best way to do things. Yeah. Tell them say the best way to do things. The best way to do things. Is the way you want to do it. Y'all heard him. The best way to do things is the way you want to do it. Thank y'all for coming along picking mushrooms with us. We're just trying to make a little video of what we're doing today. Uh, we got a pile of videos we want to make. It's hard to get them all made and done. But thank y'all for watching. We'll see you next time.